Well, we discussed uh, topics of uh, the future of global governance in food, nutrition and agriculture. And uh, the Director General uh, was very interested in that topic, especially how we organize the future relationship between policy making and science-based policy advice. And um, other topics related to um, FAO's own plans and directions in the field of climate change. You know, um, the Sustainable Development Goals, especially the ones closely related to agriculture, such as the goal number two, food security, improved nutrition, sustainable rural development, are unachievable without innovation. Innovation which makes agriculture more productive with less input use, less pressure on land, on soils, on water, um, so sustainable intensification is a science-based and innovation-dependent approach. So it's absolutely key. Innovation, however, we also need in order to uh, stimulate young people to plan their life in agriculture as business people, as entrepreneurs. So they need mechanization, access to finance. They need uh, uh, access to markets. So all this is type of innovation, not only technical things, but institutional and organizational and social innovations as well. A key step forward uh, in this field is that we bring the science communities, the thousands and thousands of academics, better together and to link them in formal ways with the policy making communities, including FAO. That's why I'm arguing, and did uh, so in today's plenary, the, we need to form an international panel on food, nutrition and agriculture. Everyone knows the international panel on the intergovernmental panel of, for climate change. We need something like that for the complex agenda to move into the future with the agriculture transformations. Um, so, the thousands of scientists and the uh, development investors and policy makers need to meet virtually and practically as we have it in climate policy uh, on the basis of an international panel on food, nutrition and agriculture. That needs to be managed well. It's not just a talk shop, but it needs to be an informed dialogue so that um, the, the big transformation needs can be implemented.